12 minutes after 5 now, September is National Childhood Cancer Awareness Month. A Bay Area mother is using her son's tragic death to help families now with children who are battling cancer. She's really hoping her experience will help heal others and bring to them what helped her, hope. Our ABC Action News anchor Vanessa Ariza has more. A love for Spider-Man, his older brother Declan, and Disney. He may only have been six, but Finn's mom, Christian Grace, says her son lived through more in those years than many of us ever will. It, to know Finn was to know he was an old soul. I mean, really, he was the kind, he had that Yasher attitude. At the age of five, in 2018, Finn was diagnosed with Ewing sarcoma, a rare cancer that grows in the bones or soft tissues around the bones. Our friends, family, neighbors really came out to support our family. She wanted to pay that forward for other families in her situation. Thus was born Finn's Fighters, a nonprofit aimed at supporting families both financially and emotionally. As Finn fought cancer, the two worked together to build the foundation. And I said, you know, you're going to inspire people or you are inspiring people at the time. I said, you're inspiring a lot of people, you know, being so brave at five years old. Sadly, Finn relapsed and in January of 2020, died at the age of six. And I think as a bereaved parent, that's the scariest thing is, is for people to stop talking about your child. Finn's Fighters isn't only helping families. For Christian, it's cathartic. It's definitely a release. It's, um, it's knowing that his memory is going to live on in a really positive way. It's knowing that he and I had conversations about what is Finn's Fighters going to look like. Last year, Finn's Fighters was able to raise close to $50,000. Now, all of that money helps families with things like medical bills, the cost of therapy, and everything in between. This year, they have surpassed that, but they are only able to do this thanks to your donations. If you would like to help, we've posted the link to Finn's Fighters on our website. Just head on over to abcactionnews.com.